welcome back. Yeah. This is another episode of X Unbox. Yeah. Oh. So today we're gonna talk about Star Wars. Yeah, and it's Boba Fett. Boba Fett. Yeah. This one is the typical iconic Star Wars character, right? It's actually the most documented uh, Star Wars character, all the way from concept art. To yeah. Finish. There's so many versions. And before saying anything, I just want to tell you guys that I'm not a Star Wars expert. Self-proclaimed, I'm not. So we just here to you know yeah. we have the figure and we just want to share yeah. with you what it is and we tell you what we see. Yeah, but we both yeah. are Star Wars fans, right? So if you know something that we don't know, please correct us. Yeah, and, yeah, you know, yeah. Comment, let us know. And this is the special edition, right? Yeah. The two two versions, and this one, uh, it's actually the Boba Fett from uh, Empire. Strike back. Yeah. yeah. We just call it Empire. Oh. Uh, plus, uh, some extra parts. Yeah. That let you uh, convert it into something else. Yeah. yeah. It's you. very good for our plot toys to provide two helmet and armor set for this yeah. figure set. You know, it creates a lot of uh, possibility when you are playing with the figures, but you mm -hmm. know, but regarding the authenticity, there's a lot of story to tell, right? Yeah, a little bit controversial, but nonetheless, I would say this is uh, a fan surface at the parts are newly made and yeah. it's it's kind of difficult to get such a different look from a different figure i don't recall any other brand make uh, the people uh mm. style armor and helmet so it's it's a fan set yeah, yeah. Oh, let's go for, for myself this one is very good because uh, did it, you have the last one? The, yeah, yeah, yeah. The, so the last one only got you know one helmet and one set of armor. Yeah. But this time, Hot Toys will buy you two different ones. Well, only for the uh, the deluxe version, right? Yeah. Like that. So we have a whole bunch of hands. Bigger. Okay. Oh, there's a stand. And this part are the extra extra accessories yeah. for the exclusive so let's have a look on the Empire Strike Back version first yep so we equipped it, uh, the basic outfit and this is from the Empire uh, basically the green is a little bit different yeah yeah it's every episode was every episode's uh, look is different right as we know as you know well he only appeared in two two, episodes. two movies New and Hope. then the uh, oh, the right cartoon. Back. Yep. Uh, well, we don't count the cartoon, but in the movies, uh, yeah, they basically look a little low. bit different. Yeah. yeah. Somebody even say that um, the Boba Fett from Episode Six is not the same guy as this one, <laughs> <laughs> because they want to, you know, they want to have some storyline that okay, that guy died, but this guy didn't die, you know. <laughs> yeah, yeah. But it's very funny. Uh, because every audience, not not every audience, understand why they use different looks when they are doing the productions. Mm. So that's why there is some pre-production versions we are going to show, and this is the movie yeah. versions. But do you know why? But do you know have have you read any document that why they changed to this versions? Oh, I, I just think it's just the process of uh, developing a movie. So when you when you make props. You know, you, you do several versions yeah. and you know, you let the art director and the director yeah. pick like, Okay, I like this one better. Oh, uh, maybe this one it's good, but I want to change mm -hmm. a little bit. So, you know, they keep changing the maybe the paint job and then, you know, yeah. Just like the cap, yeah. cap A have different version of shield. <laughs> <laughs> I think that's more for like merchandising. Yeah. And, and, and yeah. as we just discussed, uh, the first prototype of Bova is not green in color. It's white in color yes it was white uh both from the concept art and uh, the first prototype yeah. and you're looking at the uh, the jetpack right now mm -hmm. i think that's the biggest uh difference between empire and jedi mm -hmm. uh, this one is more green more military mm -hmm. uh, style and i actually have the last one from hot toys yep this is also from hot toys and this is from jedi so you can you can tell the the paint job, it's different. 
different. Yeah. This one is more colorful. You know, it's, yeah. I think it shows better in the movie on the screen yeah. than this one. It's, it looks kind of dark. The the olive green. But can you guys see any difference? I, I think they look pretty much the same, right? Yeah? Yeah. 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 Only the painting is different. Mm. Yeah. And all the details, you know, you got the, uh, the, the braid hair from the Jedi that he killed. Yeah. And oh. uh, this is the remarks of, of how many kills Remember in episode two, uh, Anakin, he has this uh, kind of like braid hair yeah. on the side, right? That's that's the sign of the powder one, right? The, oh. That's their haircut. And oh. it's kind of from the side stories that, you know, he killed several of those. Padawan. And this is like his, you know, trophy. Oh. He also carries a, a field uh, lightsaber in oh. the concept arts, right? but it's not here in the movie. But yeah. he is much much stronger in the comic. <laughs> but in the movie, it, he's well, the comic like, came after the movie actually, yeah. and uh, you know they they just don't want him to die. Yeah. They you know keep making stories and and, and uh, like the Dark Horse comics, you know that he he came out alive from from Jedi. Mm. And, you know, keep so doing his. That's adventure. probably the reasons why Boba Fett becoming the most popular really yeah, yeah 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 in the, in the movies you know just 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 after Darth Vader you know, much people yes. like him yeah. yeah I personally like him a lot so I, I have several uh, how many Boba versions Fett? of Boba Fett you keep at least two that I can remember yeah yeah yeah, yeah. and uh, you know the armor you know from the story is supposed to be uh, being able to withstand a lightsaber strike so it's very difficult for for a Jedi to kill him. Yeah. yeah. Okay. So uh, let's move yes. on to the second special lockdown. version. So it's the pre-production. Okay. Yeah. So uh, this is the special edition, right? All the special accessories. Um, you can tell the helmet, yeah. and then the jet pad, and all the guns, and uh, even the the cape. Everything looks different. So what are they? They are they are from the pre production, right? Is it PP one, PP two? Uh yeah, uh they people usually call them PP, which PP. stands for uh pre production, yep. and there are several uh editions mm. of PP. There are like mm. PP one, PP two, PP three, mm. so forth, and this is just one of the helmet that came that came out from the pre production. Yep. And the nickname for this helmet is called Years because you know you can see this oh. drawing on the on the helmet. Mm -hmm. It looks like a pair of ears. Mm -hmm. And it's also called no dent. Mm -hmm. There's no dent on the helmet compared mm -hmm. to the the movie hero helmet. So this one is called no dent and you can see side by side of the colors a little yeah. bit different yeah? yeah this is more blue and this is more green yeah. and uh the jetpack is more colorful similar to the one from jedi but it it's not exactly the same yeah and uh the controversy around this is uh, somebody who knows a lot about Boba Fett yeah. you know, he told me that um, this is from PP1 but some of these accessories are not from PP1 uh. they uh, I don't know which one is from PP2 or 3 but uh, so it's a little bit of mix and match yeah so I don't know you know like the purists they may find it oh you know you shouldn't put this with this but you know it's it's up to you it's your figure, so you're free to do anything you like. People say the width of this helmet is yeah. different. We the try to the hero it. one, it's it's a little bit wider mm -hmm. from here to here mm -hmm. in the real thing. So can you see they're different? You guys can judge with yeah. the camera. Right now we cannot judge. Yeah, we, we don't have a ruler to yeah, measure yeah. it. But at least we know that Hot Toys use different modes for this two different helmet. Yeah. yeah. 
and you can see the back also yeah. that the dental the parts cannot be made by hand so it should be the molded dental parts yeah so they should you know spend m much money double times money to make two different molds for yeah. the helmet well even this part you know the yeah. the forearm uh, accessories yeah. this is not from the movie this this are from pre-production yeah and you can also see the mandalorian logo mm. from the pp it's different yeah. from the movie one and this one is yeah. from the movie yeah well we see this several times yeah. you know even in episode seven right mm. we saw this symbol and yeah. for myself i'm very happy to have two different kinds of helmet and armor you know for my collectors we've got more accessories it makes me more feel, stuff to play with right? yeah, yeah. yeah and worth the price so i think it's good no matter the authenticity of which pre-production versions or which movie versions mm -hmm. yeah for myself i i really not an expert but I, I really don't care i just want to play and i think it's fun you know yeah, yeah, just yeah, yeah, yeah. more most like this i've never seen this before and yeah, so yeah, yeah. you know it looks cool i think this is the yeah. first pistol of Boba Fett released to the market. I think even Sideshow version didn't have this. Didn't have this. No, yeah. No, I never see this. Yeah. So it's very kind and it's good for Hot Toys to do yeah. it like that. Any comment on the on the body itself? Like the articulation or... Pretty standard, right? Regarding the articulation, I think it's very tight joints uh, Hot Toys made. So it's very reliable and... Uh, I have to put back the back pretty back. standard, right? For for yeah, pretty standard, yeah, yeah. standard. Very tight joints, yeah. and you can play with uh, you know, you know, no we play with no worry, and um, and the balance of the figure is good. You know, sometimes uh, some manufacturer didn't care about the balance of the figures. Mm. For example, the weight of the upper part is too heavy, mm. so maybe the the figure cannot stand properly. Yeah. The ankles are pretty tight, right? Yeah. Yeah. They, yeah, pretty good. And the scale is good. Yeah, it looks good. And yeah. a lot of people like myself, mm -hmm. sometimes we buy hard toys because of the head skull. Yeah. yeah. This one is probably one of those that doesn't come with a head skull, but you still love it. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, so uh, maybe with that, we just wrapped up. Um, yeah. Any more comments? I think the paint job of this helmet is the best ever. You can see the back size, especially the back size. Mm. You know, a yeah, lot the of weathering, right? Yeah, yeah, the weathering, the battle on paint is very, you know, complicated. It's several layers. It's more yeah, than yeah. One, yeah, more than one really layer good paint, one. Yeah. Really good one. And um, very close to like a movie props, you know. I mean the details, yeah. different layers. Yeah. They definitely pull something out of the, the Lucas archive and you know they, yeah. they try to match everything yeah. to, to the pictures and, and the, yeah. the actual props, yeah. So yeah, really yeah. no complaint. Yeah, so so for myself I think it's more than ninety percent uh we we appearing the you know, the look in the movies. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Very good one. Yeah. 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 So it's good for Star Wars fans and collector have one. Yeah, maybe this is kind of like a final one. <laughs> final. <laughs> the most I hope most not. I want to see the white one. Yeah, the uh, most yeah. complete versions. Yeah. Ever in the market. Yeah. Okay. Especially with two helmets. Yeah. Yeah. Wait, actually, I think this is the third one from Hot Toys, not the second one, because they also did the animation one, the blue one. Remember? Ah, uh, this is. Uh, yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. So yeah, this yeah. is the third yeah, one. Yeah, 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 not the second one. Yeah. Okay. No so complete. yeah. Yeah. Excellent. Hope you enjoyed this program. Yeah. So thanks for watching. See you next time. Bye-bye.